Hey guys, it's Graceland. Today we're gonna to be making a clay flower. Your first step is to roll it out into a line that looks kinda of like a snake. You can roll it out as long as you want, but don't make it but don't make it too thin or the flower won't work. Once you're done with that, take your utensil, but if you don't have a utensil, use a knife. Make sure you have a parent watching you when you do this. You cut them to about half an inch squares. They don't all have to be perfect. Once you finish with that, you roll those little squares into, into little spheres. Again, they don't all have to be good. When you finish, you take those spheres, take your finger, smash them so that they're flat. Then you take one of those spheres and roll it up. You might have to restart a couple times. It should look like that. Once you're done with that, you take the smash spheres and put it on. Stick it on the one you just rolled up. You keep repeating the first the that step until all the little spheres are gone. Once you're done, it should look something like this. Then you take a toothpick that is the color green, and you stick it into the bottom. Make sure it doesn't go all the way through. It should hold. Then you take it out and go put and preheat the oven to 300 degrees. Then you put it on a tray and put it in for 10 minutes. Once you're done, it should be hard. So, I just finished making the flour, now I have to put it in the oven. First, I need a pan. Also the flour. Now we can put it in the oven. It has to be for 10 minutes and set, to, and set for 20. It's been 10 minutes. So we need to get out of the oven. First, I need mitts. Okay, I got those. Now I need to take it out. So, you let it cool for 10 to 20 minutes. Then you take it off and put it on the toothpick. It's cooled for 20 minutes, now we need to put it on the toothpick. Here's the final product. Now we need to go put it in the pot, which we'll show you how to make in the next video. And there's the final product. Please like and subscribe if you want to see future videos.